Good morning, folks. Uh, Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of a very pleasant Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, and we've got a mixed bag out there. The mix goes like this. The Dow down 234. The S&P's off 11. NASDAQ 100 up 17. Russell's off 15. Semis are up 63. Tranny's down 128. I told you we had a mixed bag. You've got gold trading up 12 bucks. That's off its highs. Silver's up 13 pennies. Slightly sweet crude is up 75 cents. Natural gas up a nickel. And the 30-year Treasury down nearly two points. Print out at 1. 1820. Let's figure out what all that means by looking at that nine panel market update chart. We begin with the ES Mini upper left hand side. So, what's been tested this morning is still that rose momentum indicator top that remains in place unless we see a close above 532275. So, resistance has held. Now, this is kind of interesting. You've got the spot volatilics right now at 11 a.m. in the morning, trading above the top of its 50-day exponential moving average. It's also went ahead and moved right into one of those parabolic SAR dots out there. So this is suggesting that there is a change in trend. A close today above that 1376 level would likely take the ES Mini back even further. 5257 would be a downside target. If we take a look at the NQ, it still has its road momentum indicator top. It has not threatened that high up at the 18709 level. Um, nothing more to say there. The U.S. dollar index, it has completed the one-to-one -one A to B equals CD. Now, that was a 52% retracement of that B to C leg. Typically, when you do less than a 0.618, you'll do more than a one-to-one. -one. The next price target for the U.S. dollar index would be up at about the 10520 level. You've got gold trading higher, along with the U.S. dollar index trading higher, silver trading higher as well, but running into resistance at the top of its profile at 2551. Gold has an A to B equals CD pattern uh, that would give us a price projection of 2327. That is the likely price target. If we take a look at light speed crude, it's trading above the top of its daily profile. It's trading into the 1 to 1.272 level of its A to B equals CD pattern, and it is negating its sell the D point pattern. Looks like light speed crude wants to continue to motor higher. Its next price projection level, assuming it can get past the 8420 ish level, is 8762. Natural gas has formed a new profile, and the rally found resistance right at the top of that. Watch that. 1.857 level. If you were to get two consecutive closes above it, you would at least have a profile change in trend for natural gas. And finally, the 30-year Treasury. It's got a TD9 count top. That formed way back here in the trading session of March the 7th. And now price is likely going to target. It's a swing low down from February 22nd. That's in the range of between 117.11 at the bottom and 118.09 at the top. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Ed Show, if you will. If you're off to start your Monday, have a magnificent one. Thanks so much for joining us, and we look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care now.